Shem Abu Babro Ruho Kadisho Hadalaho Shariro Amin. Dearly beloved brothers and sisters in Christ, let me begin with quoting a scripture from the first epistle of St. Peter, chapter 3, verse 15. It says, Always be prepared to give an answer to everyone who asks you to give reason for the hope that you have. But do this with gentleness and respect. Let me repeat. Always be prepared to give an answer to everyone who asks you to give the reason for the hope that you have. But do this with gentleness and respect. 1 Peter chapter 3, 15 Dearly beloved, Every believer has a God-given responsibility to defend his faith and to be able to explain his faith to others. For us, the Syrian Orthodox, for us, we must be able to um, testify what it means to be a child of God and how our church life encourages us to be a true Christian. Today there is an urgent need of a quality discipleship in our church. And it should begin with a quality education, a quality Christian education, which includes the Holy Scripture and the teachings of the Holy of Fathers. The discipleship in our church today is as as important as it was in the early um, church. The faithfulness of the uh, of Jesus and the centuries ensured us to continue and motivated early we emphasis sacraments called Kurbon. The worship is central to activities. Or we have into an importance of discipling and preparing our members for the significant roles of service within the church, in the society, and ministry around the world. Uh, Christian education is primarily focusing on <clears throat> uh, making disciples and teach them. But beyond teaching, Christian leaders are to encourage disciples to let me quote, go and make disciples of all nations, unquote. Our church has to move from our so-called uh, school mentality to a disciple-making state of mind because we cannot ignore the great commission of our Lord as we see in Matthew chapter 28. It was not just an option. It was a commission and a command. Hence, such teachings and equipping our members is necessary for ongoing discipleship so that our Holy Church can be a vibrant mission force in the community and around the world. Church has to grow. Our members have to be, uh, have to be trained uh, and equipped in their faith and tradition. Furthermore, Lord has promised us that He would be with us for this important task. In the Old Testament times, we see that uh, the instructions were given uh, through various forms. It started with uh, the family life, then uh, uh, the um, uh, tribal life and the tribal responsibilities, oral instructions, then uh, Lord taught them through captivity, um, and uh, he gave instructions through prophets, teachers, uh, judges, and he also uh, taught them, instructed them through the festivals, feasts, and even through fasting. Uh, when we come to the New Testament era, we can see that our Lord Jesus Christ was a great teacher. And we also see that uh, how apostles taught through their ministry and the, through their writings. And we know that the 
uh, great scholarship of our church fathers, defending the uh, Christian faith uh, before the persecutors and guiding the Holy Church through their spiritual leadership. Now, in this time of the social media, our church can uh, achieve greater milestones through this new uh, platform and opportunity. And um, I would like to congratulate my fellow members, fellow brothers and sisters in the Haimonoso team for bringing up this new series called Uraho, meaning the way. The goal of Uraho, as I learned, is to reach out to our English-speaking audience around the world and to invite them to listen to and enjoy the rich and powerful resources of our Holy Syriac Orthodox Church and of its Blessed Fathers. We wish all success to Uraho, the new English version of Haimonuzo and the internet-based Christian ministry, and pray that our God Almighty help them to enlighten thousands of people through their selfless ministry. And we hope and pray that uh, the viewers also uh, may be blessed and uh, be proud of the rich uh, heritage of our Holy Syriac Orthodox Church. May the grace of God be with you all and uh, we uh, wish again all success to this new project called Uraho. More Tito Sildo Metropolitan. <laughs>